on the mineral line here. And does he have anything left? He's just got the queen left in the main base. Nothing else uh, to defend against air units. Really just only the two queens. He does have mutas on the way, but because they, I do have cloak, uh, he has really nothing to counter that yet. Is this a lair? Yes, it is a lair. So he will be able to get an overseer out, um, but it could take some time. There goes Cloak, <laughs> flying right past the mutas. I say, oh, I can't even attack him anyways. And I take out the queen first, and then I start going for the drones. He instantly goes for a spore crawler. I, I figured that, so I take that out immediately. He does not cancel it. Uh, so I'm going to be going for this hatchery. No, I go uh, and try to take finish off the drones. And I fly over and oh, is that another spine crawler? Or sorry, spore crawler. Let's take that out. One of my banshees does uh, lose energy, uh, but he doesn't. Oh, now just getting the mutas over. Of course, that was the last banshee to come out, so it did not have enough energy to hang out with the other ones in invisibility mode. Or whatever you guys want to call it. Taking out all but two, all but eight harvesters. Uh, just two right there. I don't know where the others are. They probably on the gas? No, they're just, just catch up. Down to two harvesters. And he's only got a hundred uh, He's only got 94. Oh, he's down to 44. If I can take out this harvester and that spore collar is allowed to finish, I have officially won the game. But that Banshee does uh, finish cloaking, and I don't take out that drone. Take it out. See, the Spore Crawler is up. He's down to 44 uh, minerals. Is he producing anything? No, but look. Oh, I fly right over the Spore Crawler. I fall right into the trap. If I had taken out that drone right there, if I was paying attention um, and saw that and took it out, that would have been the last drone, and it would have been game over. There simply would have been nothing he could do uh, with so little minerals and not enough to make another drone. How much is the drone? They are 50? Yes, of course, they are 50. But more Banshees on the way. Uh, after such a harass successful Banshee harass, what choice do I have but to keep going with it? I mean, I almost won the game with it. Why would I stop? He does have five Banshees, or sorry, five Mutas out. Where did that drone go? It went to the main base. Uh, so he is... No, he didn't even go for the uh, the second drone first. He went for the Overlord, it looks like. Sorry, Overseer. There we go, 59. And there we go, getting another drone. I mean, it's pretty much back to square one, thanks to three Banshees. I mean... The, the, this was incredibly awesome and a real big eye-opener for me that I can at least send at least one Banshee out, see how it works. And now massive amounts of missile turrets going down because I did see those mutilisks and I assume that he's going to want to counter with his own harass. Uh, I don't have my army out to defend this expansion. It's really up for grabs. Is there an SCV there? Yes, he's still alive. And out of position missile turrets. I did not expect him to go all the way around like he did. So he is able to pick off these uh, these workers. But I have plenty of energy left on the orbital command. I don't just need uh, 50 to survive. And I'm going to be going for that lair with five banshees it looks like. Taking out the drones. How many does he have left? Looks like he's just got two left. So once again, if I had taken out those two. He does have enough minerals to... Uh, no, not anymore. So he did use them again. If I had taken out uh, those last couple uh, drones, it would have been game over again. Oh, but that's there. 
Look at that, 14 health is now just regenerating to 15, 16. Oh my goodness. If I had just one couple more shots, would have taken down the lair. And, oh my gosh. But once again, uh, game's pretty much over. I just have to move out with the army that finally did take out those uh, mutas. Of course, I had missile turrets all over the map except where I needed them. Here comes Zerglings, but uh, these uh, siege tanks, I believe it's called Pop Popping. <laughs> they're, uh, they're performing drive-bys on these guys. One tank goes down, but considering all the Zerglings and, ban and Banelings that were sacrificed to do it, I am not too worried about it at all. Looking at that, he's down to 20 supply. I am still at 73, and uh, still have a ton of uh, a ton of advantage here. He is spreading creep, uh, keeping an eye on the expansions at the high yield, uh, but it's pretty much game over. Wasting the last of his army as they all die. Taking out the last uh, spine crawler there, and he's pretty much down to just uh, the mutas and his drones. Once those mutas go down, which they should, I do have enough marines there. He takes out the tank first, he doesn't even focus down the marines. So he's down to 11 supply against 67. Looking at the units lost. Oh, I did lose more in resources because he was able to get those tanks, but 57, most of those were harvesters. Thanks to those banshees. So I'm able to take out... Yeah, he's down to just... Uh, what is he down to here? One meter. Now three roaches coming out. Uh, that's going to be his last ish effort. They are able to take out one stranded marine there who was uh, a little too Leroy there. Down goes the Muta. Down goes one. And now the other. No, maybe. There go the Roaches. Now backing off. They want to get one shot off and then run away. That's not going to work. And down goes everything. He's down to nothing but drones. And out oh, income banshees and Vikings for good measure. And he leaves the game. No GG. I don't necessarily blame him. I did go for the banshee harass. Uh, but since he was so completely unprepared for it, I had to go for it again. I really had no choice. Um, I didn't want to allow him to come back into the game. Um, so there we go. Banshees. Highly effective. I, 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 I will admit that I underestimated them. I might be using them later on. This was, this was really a game that showed me, you know, that Banshees are not, uh, are not the weakest unit that I thought they were, or as cheesy as I thought. I mean, uh, you can say that the Banshees won me the game, but I, you know, the army is what made him quit. Yeah, you know, it's a give and take here. But I hope you guys enjoyed the game. Hope you learned something. Hope you laughed. If you like the videos, uh, like. If you dislike, go ahead and hit the dislike button. Let me know why. Uh, either in the comments or in a private message. And uh, if you guys want to see more from me, I do post every day. Hit that subscribe button and you will get them directly into your subscriptions module is what they call it. I did look that up. Uh, hope to see you guys next time. Bye.